Hey guys, it is Jess with Watch Kitty Shrink, and I have a special guest here today. It is my mom. You can call her Mama Cat since I'm Kitty. That's what I call her. And we are going to do a review for you today. <laughs> so, in case this is your first time here, you should know that I am a weight loss surgery patient. I say that because um, a weight loss surgery patient has to eat a lot of protein every day. So, I'm very used to protein tasting things. And my mama is going to try them just to see how the taste is. She's not a weight loss surgery patient. She doesn't really eat a lot of protein products like, I mean, she eats meat, but not like protein bars, protein shakes, stuff like that. So she's just gonna give you a normal person's viewpoint. So um, this is all stuff from the website Eat Me Guilt Free. And in the description box, I'm gonna have a coupon code in case it's not there when you first click on this video because my descriptions tend to take a while to show up. The website is just one word, eatmeguiltfree.com. And the code to get 10% off is just watch kitty. <laughs> It's just watch kitty. So let's just jump right in. I have been dying to try some of this stuff. Again, weight loss surgery patient, so I try to eat low sugar, watch my carbs, and um, obviously I want protein. So we're just going to try this. This is just the brownie, and it has, um, the whole thing has 160 calories, 5 grams of fat, five net carbs and 22 grams of protein let's just try that i'll try it first and tell you looks good doesn't mm -hmm. it okay oh. i think it's really good i think it tastes like those little debbie brownies you know like the little tiny square ones it's got a little bit of a drier taste than those, but it's pretty good. Think about <laughs> your face. It'd be good, but remember, I don't like chocolate cake or anything. Yeah, she doesn't really care for chocolate stuff. It's definitely the bite that's the best. It's okay, with, though. Yeah, with the icing, it's really good. It's a little dry without the icing, but still really good. It'll help you get your sweet tooth cravings away. Okay, so this one is, and all their products are gluten-free. This is the birthday cake, and it has 175 calories, 8 net carbs, and only 3 grams of sugar, and 22 grams of protein. Now, I'll say before I try this, I like actual birthday cake. I have never liked birthday cake flavored things. So let's give it a try. We're going to put these in a plastic bag, the ones we want to keep. That was good. I think this one's good, too. They're definitely, you know, a little bit of a dry texture because of the protein, but the taste is pretty good, I think. What do you think? Dry. Dry. Yeah, they're very dry tasting. If you get a bite from the top, you see how the top's shiny? If you get about from the top, it's pretty good. But down here, it's a little dry. But again, I'd eat it. Yeah. It ain't disgusting or nothing. No. I didn't throw up. No. <laughs> okay, so I'm excited for mom to try this. It's a blonde brownie. They call it a blondie. She used to love these from Applebee's. Again, something I've never liked is a blondie, but we'll try it. It is 160 calories, 5 grams of fat, and 5 net carbs, zero sugar, and 22 grams of protein. That's kind of strange. You'd think they would advertise more that these were, if these were sugar-free because, holy, that's a whole nother thing you could market to, being sugar-free. I don't care for that, but I don't like blonde brownies. That's the better of all of them. This is your favorite of all of them? Yeah. Of all of them so far, my favorite is birthday cake, probably. No, that's good. You like the blonde brownie? Okay. I didn't like the blonde brownie at all, but I've never liked them. I don't even like the ones with sugar, so. 
Okay, I'm really excited to try this. What is it? Cinnamon Toast Breakfast Cake. And Cinnamon Toast Crunch used to be my favorite cereal. So, it's 160 calories, 5 grams of fat, 5 net carbs, 0 sugars again, and 22 grams of protein. And I didn't like that blonde brownie at all. And that was your favorite so far? Yeah. Let's see about Cinnamon Breakfast Cake. This tastes more like banana nut bread to me. I like banana nut bread. I know. Nut. See what you think. That's what that tastes like to me. Like a cinnamon banana nut bread. You, yeah. You get what I'm saying? Yeah. You taste that too? That's pretty good. You like it? Yeah. Well, you like better. These are the blondie. 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 Okay, guys. We just got two more. Um. So, this one is a peanut butter cookie called PB Crack. I've never liked peanut butter cookies either, but I mean, everything I've pulled out, I'm like, I don't like this, but um, I am obsessed with peanut butter. So, you like peanut butter cookies, don't you? Okay. It is 180 calories, um, nine net carbs, seven sugars, and 16 grams of protein. So, this has a little less protein than the others. And more sugar. And more sugar, yeah. So we'll probably just take a tiny bite of this one just to be on the safe side. Because I do get dumping syndrome, which is an intolerance to sugar. That's pretty good. That's good. Okay, you know like the... Of course, it's got my sugar in it. I know. You know the Little Debbie cookies? It's like got the cookie and then the white stuff and then the cookie? You know what I'm talking about? Mm -hmm. That's what that tastes like. It tastes like the bottom of that. You like that? Ooh, that's good. It's really good. That's a 10. Yeah, that's good. I get why they call it peanut butter crack. That would be crack. That is, that's good. You like that better than the blondie? Yeah, get yeah. that out. We're going to eat this after the video. This is hands down both of our favorites so far. So the last thing to try, and I saved it for last, is this chocolate peanut butter bliss. Mom and I are both, our favorite candy is Reese Cups. So, something with chocolate and peanut butter, it's got to be good. It is 212 calories. It is 11 net carbs, 8 sugars, and 22 grams of protein. So, it's got a lot of sugar, too. That peanut butter cookie was good, wasn't it? Okay. Some of their stuff's a little hard to get into, but I'm going to try to make sure I like, if I have to half it and make sure I get some of the peanut butter. See? The peanut butter is kind of in the middle. You see? So I'm going to kind of break it in half. Oh, okay. So it's not like gooey peanut butter. It's like peanut butter all in it. I'm going to get a piece right there with the peanut butter. It's okay. I don't like chocolate. You don't like chocolate? She didn't like it? I think it's okay. It's a little too chocolate for me, too. If you've watched my videos for a while, you'll actually see that I've never been much of a sweets person anyway, but it was okay. Overall, definitely hands down the best is the peanut butter cookie crack. The you blondie. agree? Yeah. Second for mom is the blondie. Second for me would be the um, birthday cake. What was your least favorite? Talk. The first chocolate brownie? <laughs> or that one. Or that one. But I'm not, you know. Yeah, I'd have to say this was my least favorite too. But none of them were disgusting. Uh, a good way to get 22 grams of protein in when you are um, craving a snack or something sweet. I mean, it's a good, it's a good alternative. She's sneaking into the cookie right now. Okay, I'm yeah. gonna have to too. That right there is worth it. The cookie is really good, guys. And this stuff is not expensive, so. Just let me know if you guys try it and what you think. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Please say something about my mama because I'm always trying to get her to do videos with me and I had to beg for this one. We love you guys. Bye. Blow a kiss. <laughs> Bye. Uh, so I'm going to record my memory. I don't know if I like it or not. Left enough to taste. <laughs>
I'm gonna let my mama try them and record this. She's a diabetic, so I'm letting her try them because these are also very low in sugar. She liked the chocolate brownie. She don't know about the aftertaste of the blondie. No. Don't aftertaste. like it? Oh, you don't like the aftertaste of the regular yeah. brownie. Yeah. How do you feel about the blondie? See, <laughs> swallowed it. I can't swallow that one yet. I think it's good. You like it better than the regular brownie? Mm -hmm. It's not leaving a bad aftertaste. Okay. Now give her this birthday cake here in my arm. That's the birthday cake. Well. Just just pinch it off, bite it, whatever you want to yeah, do. Yeah, you don't have to get a big bite. Yeah. Well, they're pretty good. Pretty good? Don't leave too much of a protein aftertaste? The the dark one did, didn't it? Mm -hmm. I thought so, too. Like this one? Birthday cake. So far, I like it better. It was my second favorite. And it was Daddy's number one favorite. It doesn't now, taste that sweet. Now, this one is... You want to save the cookie for last? Okay, what she got? A cinnamon toast breakfast cake. Ooh. Daddy didn't like that one? He said it was all right. Guys, I'm so sorry. I forgot to record my dad doing these. Terrible. Make him do it again. I might. Don't like that one? Don't like that one. Yeah. All right. Now, this one is a peanut butter and chocolate brownie. My mama is like me. She loves peanut butter. Can't get enough peanut butter. I don't know. I love chocolate, too. <laughs> How do you like, you like that one? I like that one. So far, it's that one and a birthday cake. So far, those are your favorites. Now, mm -hmm. this is mine and mommy's favorite. It was actually daddy's least favorite, but what it's, is it's a peanut butter cookie. It was mine and mommy's favorite. Now, that would not seem to have no taste. You didn't, so your favorite is either the birthday cake or the peanut butter brownie? And I think it's the peanut butter brownie. The peanut butter brownie. Okay, guys, there you have it.